Okay, we fitted the spinner base uh, or the prop base extension. Just push it straight in because you take your rotary lug, your lugs out. And you gotta make sure that you tighten the bolts up to 24 Newton meters to hold the extension on. You'll note there, there's a red mark. That's the centre reference for the outers that hold the prop blades and also the spinner. So everything's got to go back to the same spot. And this is all balanced. You can actually see a weight in there. There's a weight. So this is how you get it from the factory. It's all actually balanced. So we're about to put the prop on and uh, there's coloured dots on the prop ends as well as the coloured matches, dots. Matches the blade. So these props had a green, a blue and a yellow yeah, one. And then the red matches. And then the red so matches, matches the red in here. Yeah. And yeah. on the back of, of the backing plate, backing plate should there's match. also a red. Red matches so red. that matches that. So red, red, red. red red. And the spinner has a red dot on it as well. So that all matches up in the same, in the same area. So so red to red, in this case, it goes on like that. We put it on and then we just adjust the pitch, which I'll show you. It's and you'll see dot. also that the, Didn't have a red dot. Yeah, it has a red dot on the oh, outside. The There's a red dot on the outside. And you also see that the spinner is balanced. You don't remove stickers or any of that sort of stuff. So we'll get together and put the rest of it together. And then I'll show you us we'll, doing the pitch, how we do that prop. You have to loosen these off, calibrate the unit. And I don't know if you can see this, but it's really sensitive to try and get right. Okay, 25.1, 49.8. But the big thing is make sure that the spirit level is in the middle when you hang it on the prop. And you also hang it right on the start of the edge of the titanium strip. So what do we got? 24, we need it at 25.1. What was the number when you first turned it on? What? What do we got? That's 20. Okay, so it's 25.2. Depending on how you do the screws up, that will change. So if I put more weight to the bottom, it usually increases the pitch a little bit, or you can put more weight to the top. Yep, 25.2. Is it still? Yeah, 25.2. Is it? No, just to come back a bit. Yeah, that's it now, 25. Yep. 25? Yep. It's supposed to be 25.1, but Danny doesn't want it pitched quite as much because he reckons it will. No, it's 24.9, yeah. Yeah, which, will be, which is what the other ones will be. Yeah. They've got to be within point 0.1 of each other, so. So if one's 24.9 and the other one's 25, that apparently is fine. Okay, so what is that reading? 24.9, okay. That's well, a good place to start. Righto, the, um, the prop and the spinner's on with the extension. Danny's done some work on his carbies. Just take the mill off it from the next order. Yeah. The, the prop, one, this is what he had on there, but I've got a standard prop to base on there. Is one inch longer than what he had on. So he had 10 and 3 eighths clearance before, now he's got 9 and 3 eighths of an inch clearance on the ground. So we might have to put a, an extension on the nose leg, which a lot of savannas have. So. Uh, but it's one inch difference between the original bolly. You had the 68 inch bolly, didn't you? 66 is what it physically measures, but. So it measures 66? Yeah. Okay. Well, this measures 68.8, I think. So it's about 10 
So we're gonna go for a start shortly. Danny's actually done some work on his carbs. So we're gonna balance the carbs and everything first. That'll give it a bit of a run. And uh, we'll see what it's like just on start for us first up. Already. See that it's crosswind. We saw back already. I thought it was, I really, <laughs> I'm gonna land. <laughs> 